society is in a collective delusion, a collective conspiracy to ignore the present moment in favor of what we think is the future, right? Like, I notice the more I let myself be pulled along by the pace of society and I get caught in this idea that happiness is in the future, right? Or as soon as I do this, this, and this, then I can be at peace. <clears throat> that seems to be the way that society operates as a, as a whole, you know? Just under this assumption that my peace, my happiness, my contentment is somewhere else. And I find that I get caught in that as well. And I find that the more I'm able to just be where I am, be here in the moment, the better I feel, the happier I am. When I am constantly, you know, just racing to the next moment, trying to get there, trying to get where I'm going. What happens when you finally get there, right? You're looking forward again. You're never really present. And I feel like you're gonna miss your whole life if you do that, right? If you're always chasing the future, if you're always going towards a future moment, at what point do you finally get to stop and say, I made it, I'm here. It's almost like it's never gonna happen, right? You're always just gonna continue looking forward and never really look around and appreciate it. And so that seems to be a common theme of life, of my experience, is the battle between living in a society that is plagued by the constant chase of the future. You know, living in a society that's always looking forward and never really seeming to slow down and appreciate life. You know, I, I live between the battle between that and my own need to, to connect to the moment, to connect to nature, right? Because if you live at the pace of nature, if you spend time in nature, you will see, you will notice that nature is not in a hurry. Nature's not going anywhere. Nature is grounded and rooted in stillness, in the moment. There's a quote that goes, uh, it goes, moving slowly, nature comes on its, uh, sorry, spring comes on its own and the grass grows on its own time, right? You don't have to rush. You can't rush nature and you can't rush the seasons. And we are nature, right? So it just feels like so much of the way that we live is out of touch with where we're from, with the planet that we live on, right? You go spend some time in the woods and realize this, that nothing is in a hurry out there, right? Then you come into this human civilization and it's like, people are all behaving as if there's not enough time, that there's not enough to go around, right? We just have to chase to get something, get get there. I just need to get there. But then when you get there, are you really there? Or are you just keep, is it just a hamster wheel, right? So that's something I'm always battling with, you know? But I just wanted to say that I find the more that I can allow myself to live and be present where I am, the happier I am. Because no matter what you're looking for in life, you can only be ha found where you are. You know, peace, joy, contentment. Instead of the mindset of kind of more, it's like more greedy, right? It's like, I want more, I always want more. I need to get there, I need to get there, and then and then I'll be okay. It's not how it works. You, you know, you're never gonna be in the perfect spot to be okay. You need to find that feeling where you are, or else you never will find it. <laughs>